Hey guys, I am going to be making some chili in the crock pot. I haven't done chili in a really long time. So I've got the burger in there with a little bit of water. I'm going to let this cook on high for the next three hours. And then I'll add in um, some chili ingredients. I've got onions here that are come out of the freezer. I'm going to put those in in a minute. Um, but I'll show you what ingredients I put in after I let the burger cook a little bit. So that's what I'm going to do today. Put some chili in the crock pot. Alright y'all, talk to you later. Alright y'all, I am going to also be making tea. This is my tea jug so it looks real hazy looking because that's all I do is make tea in it and I wash it out periodically. Um, but that's my tea jug so it's nice and stained. Um, I always put a little bit of this in it lately. This is um, sugar-free raspberry syrup for the sweetener and then I go ahead and add my tea bags I fill this up the rest of the way and just let it sit for hours okay y'all so this is the tea that I use this is the family size ones and I can't remember how many quarts this jug is but I put four of these in for one let's see I think it's a four quart jar so I use four of these for one container. So I'm going to put these in and just let it sit for the day. Alright y'all, I went ahead and put some onions in. I'm just going to put a little seasoning in and I'm going to let this cook. I'll put the green peppers in later. Okay y'all, so this is the final product. It's still cooking. Yes, there's corn in there. I'm just using up what's in the um, canned goods. So a can of beans, can of corn, can of mushrooms, there's onions, green peppers, can of tomatoes, can of tomato sauce, spices, chili powder, garlic powder, um, an all seasoning, there's hamburger in there, and I think that's about it. So I'm just letting this cook, and then I will divvy it up and put it in the freezer. So that's a quick crock pot chili, y'all. Alright, talk to you later. Good morning guys, happy Monday, May 6th. I am getting ready to go off to work. I know it's dark in here, sorry. Um, my sinuses are just ugh this morning. So, very long week. I've got ahead of me this week. I've got three clients today, so it's gonna be a very busy day. Um, prayers that I get through it today. It takes everything I have to get through work, but that's okay. Um, I'm very thankful that I have work and that I can pay the bills, so it is what it is, y'all. Um, and that I can work for myself, I'm super thankful for that one. But, alright, dishwasher's done, sorry. Um, alright, I've got to go um, shut that off and then get ready to get out of here in about five minutes so I can get on to work and get on with my day. So I will chat with you later. Sorry the camera is shaky. Talk to you later. Hey guys, just got done with my first client and i um, going to eat lunch real quick and then head on to my next client. I've got two more after this. So I'm going to eat lunch real quick and then head on and I don't know if you can see the swelling on my finger right here. Um, I busted a blood vessel on my finger it started swelling I'm trying to push pressure on it to keep it from swelling up too much but I was looking for a band-aid but I guess I don't have any in here um, to wrap around it to keep the swelling down on it I don't know I used my finger the wrong way and I busted a vessel I guess um, but couldn't find band-aids so I can't do that but anyway on with life so let me show you what I've got for lunch I just kind of threw some stuff in my lunch pail this morning because I was lazy so let me show you all right y'all there was one leftover Greek yogurt in the fridge from my mother when she was here and then I have some leftover sausage that needs to get ate up you can see it because it's all fogged up and then a diet root beer. That's what I'm going to have for lunch right now. 
And when I get home, I'll probably have um, something else. But that's what I'm going to have, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and eat this so I can get on with the rest of my day. Talk to you later. That's my lunch view, y'all. I don't know if you can hear the waves. Peaceful and beautiful. Alright, y'all. Talk to you later. Hey, guys. I am done with my one client and my third client. So, done two. I've got a third one that I'm going to do. As you can see, I've got compression tape on my finger to keep it from swelling. And I've been looking for my allergy medicine all morning that I thought I brought with me, but I don't can't find it so anyway I'm off to um, my last client for the day so hopefully you're having a good day I will chat at you later hey guys just got from just got home from work you know what I mean <laughs> I'm tired um, gonna eat something it's just now four o'clock so I'm gonna eat something and I will show you what that is when I get to that point. Boy, I look terrible in this lighting. There we go. Um, I'll eat something. I'll show you what that is here in a minute. But like I said, I just got home. So I will chat with you in a little while. Hey, guys. Um, I can't see it. I'll have to do better lighting, but my finger's nice and bruised. My finger's nice and bruised, but... Um, I had it wrapped till just now. So I'm eating leftovers from when my mama was here, which is taco, burger, and then I put some salsa in there and cheese and sour cream. And I'm going to eat up these from when she was here. And then I'm having some sugar-free cookies. So that's what I'm having right now, y'all. Hey, guys. My um, neighbor that helps me out sometimes trim down my plants. He puts them in the thing. He cuts them off and trims them and puts them in there to make them fuller and thicker. And Mom and I picked all the onions. And I'll show you. So he trimmed these. So these will grow bigger and stronger. And then I'll show you the other ones too. This is one of the other ones. And then the other one. I have four of these. And then he also trimmed down my hibiscus because that gets trimmed down before rainy season and then shoots right up afterwards. End of the bird feeding, y'all. Until I buy some more, that's the rest of the bird food. Filled it up. We haven't filled it in a couple days. My mom filled it the last time, so went ahead and put some bird food in there. But the birdies will have to wait, because that's all they get. Working on my vitamins, y'all. This is the one that I have left. I try to prepare for the weeks and fill up all my vitamins, but I'm running short. I've ran out of a few things. Um... So I need to go to the store and pick up some more. I'm low on this. I've got another week maybe of this, the collagen. And seek help. I take for my thyroid. I need to order some more of that. I can't get that at the stores. Um, and this, I'm just trying to finish this up. I'm not going to continue taking that. But I need to get some more allergy medicine and stuff like that because I'm running low on everything. But this is what I do for my vitamins every week. I try to get prepared for the whole week so I have no excuse I don't take my vitamins. So a little quick idea is to get some little containers, y'all, and fill them up for the week so you have your vitamins. And they're really good for travel also. But I figured I'd give you that little tip for today. Is a great way to keep yourself taking your vitamins every morning. I just take one of these out and it's all ready to go. Alright y'all, talk to you later. Hey guys, I am 
I'm getting ready to go get a shower. I'm completely exhausted, so um, I've got to make a phone call, and I am going to go get in the shower and get ready for bed. It's only a little after 5 o'clock, but I'm completely exhausted. Um, always am after work. As soon as I sit down, I start getting really tired, so I was going to try to work on a video, but... I'm just too tired. I'll do it in the morning. So, I'm just going to let you guys go. I will talk to you later. And remember, y'all, to live a simple, happy, healthy, tiny life. Talk to you tomorrow.